don't know if you got a chance to see this but i think it's pretty much out there it's floating all around social media and it also came down in like in the news as well where samyukta hegde was cornered over there in a park because of a uh, indecent behavior and this video i mean initially i just saw just a small clipping of the video that she had posted where this lady who is kavita reddy i guess like she was trying to hit the other girl but later on i saw the full version where she went live the entirety of that video is like around 14 minutes long that video was disturbing i mean the whole situation was gnarly and the way samyukta just handled the whole situation itself was quite commendable and she was being very brave as well i know she broke down a bit but that that was sort of bound to happen because you are just you know two people standing over there against such a mob mentality there's a mob that is just surrounded all over you are been locked up in a you know damp park and you are you are asked not to leave the whole video that you can actually you know see it she kept calling her ma'am and she kept calling the police sir so i think she handled it pretty well pretty sure she could have handled it a little more better but uh, she broke down a bit and she just started really looking for people to help over there and hardly anybody came forward just about couple of people so samyukta like what i personally would like to say to you if you ever come across this video or if you ever come across this message or whatever is that most of the people are filled with self hatred they are filled with jealousy they just do not like people being successful they just do not like seeing people rise up the growth chart becoming achievers they just don't because they they are not achievers themselves so and you being an actress i would say you should have been a little aware of this situation you could have been a lot more uh, smart about the situation because when you do go to up go to a public park and uh, you're wearing a sports bra and you're trying to work out people who do not even have a reason to come at you will still do because they know you as an actress of sandalwood and you're keen that pretty much you're famous they want to just take you down now given this all you know bloody drug scam happening in the sandalwood industry and it is being stretching towards bollywood as well people just do not want to see other other ones you know flourishing so that is the only thing that i would like to say to samyukta that she could have been a little more mindful and coming to uh, miss uh, mrs kavita reddy so she apparently is a congress leader i think anything like pretty much everything she did was completely illegal because i mean she wanted to give up police complaint she, well you know she has the right to do so she can just easily go give up you know lodge a complaint and the police will look into it but instead she was blocking her she was trying to attack her and uh, you know she was pretty much doing everything that is illegal if she wants to you know condemn them saying that uh, that was not the right thing to do or they were showing some kind of an indecent behavior i mean samyukta seemed totally fine that lady recording her she could have just recorded some yukta doing so called indecent behavior and they should could have you know produced this to the police and filed a complaint instead of that she started taking things into her own hand she also gave this statement apology and i don't think she truly apologizes over here i'm pretty sure she was pressurized by her party members or you know other uh, influential people out there so that she remains in a safer spot but in the apology she mentions as to how she thought that she was doing a moral policing apparently there was a music that was being played out loud by these girls samyukta and her friends and that is what caused this whole disruption apparently she got a complaint which she wanted to look into and the next day when she came over there to the park she saw these girls working out with her, with their hoops with such loud music and that is the reason she confronted and apparently samyukta's friend called her a bloody bitch and 
it's possible she might actually have but before that there could be there, there should be some kind of a trigger i think that trigger was kavita reddy given the aggression she was going with because i didn't see any other girls being aggressive and she says in her twitter post uh, um, that this is the reason why she confronted them but if you see the video that the live video that samyukta was making in the entirety of the video you do not see kavita reddy mentioning anything to do with music the whole time she kept talking about their dress nanga nach like you know such indecent behavior the whole time she kept talking about her clothes there was this another you know bloody guy who just stood there with a red t-shirt red shirt or something uh, saying that samyukta like i don't know why she was even getting so much worried about what this uh, stupid you know bloody heinous atrociously low life guy was talking about because i mean it's not just going to happen so easily among all these things the most irritable thing that happened to me was the policeman the policeman because you know why i'm really irritated with the police is because when the police okay basically you know we have a constitution we have legal rules that are written down and what is a what what is a policeman supposed to do they are supposed to police each individual's rights but instead he comes over there and like a meek person you know he just asks samyukta to just leave from the premise instead of trying to you know control the mob he's just asking the, her to leave because you know she was totally not outside of her right to do whatever she was doing she was totally in her rights to go there work out and she wasn't showing any particular you know indecent behavior while the mob that gathered over there was showing a lot of lot of uh, aggressiveness they even locked her up and police people they are just standing over there like a, without even doing anything about it they are supposed to be a lot more responsible do their work more properly instead of trying to suck up to all those so called leaders of certain parties i think she was congress party i i hope the whole case has been resolved now i'm looking for some kind of a carry bag to carry all this and look what i found You remember how I told that I'm going to run quite a lot more on Sunday compared to the regular days and I did and <laughs> my legs are paining like crazily there's a lot of ache in my muscles because it's been a while that i went to the gym and oh and yesterday i ran 10 kilometers no actually to be more precise i ran 10.5 kilometers which went pretty well and i was pushing myself i split the whole run because to make sure that you know i'm getting in that distance in me end of the day i need to make sure that my body is used to covering so much of distance my lung capacity has already pretty much increased stamina but stamina wise i did not have any problem even when i completed 10 kilometers i was doing just fine i mean i i was just feeling like i can do you know 20 more to be honest but my legs were giving up and that is where all this protein comes in so that is why i'm getting a lot of lot of protein i got some oats as well and there is some peanut butter as well so just making sure i'm consuming enough from now on to make sure my training goes very well see again those people hdfc bank people they said they'll come at 11
it's 12:30 now that is just so unprofessional i mean it's not the first time i'm experiencing it i don't know if you guys noticed this earlier but fluffy has been shaved off like crazily this is all chandan's fault did chandan make you ugly <laughs> uh. no, it is tuesday afternoon close to 1 o'clock right now and i just finished my edit and i'll be exporting it and then i got to post it uh, but i still haven't had my food so i got to go now